Hey guys, and welcome to another brand new video. In this video, we actually have quite a few brand new locations all having stock with the PlayStation 5s. A lot of things we're watching for too as well. And at the end of the day, a lot of things happy folks that will be all being spread on out all throughout, well, here in the first place too as well. So we should have a pretty good day, at least in my opinion. Uh, it kind of seems kind of weird though, because we did lose a few different locations, like some stop uh, spots actually lost some of their stock too as well, and it did go a little bit on the lower side, but there are still some pretty nice and easy location still having stock available so we're going to talk about all throughout this all throughout this video so hope you guys are all stay tuned relax and enjoy as well thank you all so much for even watching the first place make sure you guys are subscribed with the notifications on as well for the brand new playstation 5 giveaway the amazon links down below for the ps5 disc target links amazon links and all that and we have the twitter and twitch room as well so go and check that on out in case you guys would like so very first and foremost, all of you lovely folks, we have been seeing a huge, huge amount of stock when it comes to the Target side. Now, as you guys know, we have been mentioning and linking up Target quite a bit as of recently. Target's been doing pretty good, has been getting pretty good stock, and overall been flowing pretty good. So we've been having loads upon loads upon loads upon loads of folks out here getting and receiving their Target stock. It's been going pretty good. So uh, we even see this. Over here from Bronco, same things for all the info, Target.com came through. And now we have some nice little successes over here with them actually finally going and getting their console too on top of that. And obviously the people are just roasting them for doing a vertical setup, although I myself have also done the vertical setup. But as well, we've also seen a lot more other folks too as well chiming on in when it comes to this. Finally it's in my hands and I finally bought it from Target itself. So we've been seeing loads upon loads of stock all floating around with it. We're seeing a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of Target PlayStation 5 stock basically coming on through. We've been having areas pretty much all throughout the nation. We've been having people even using the link down below and having a chance to go get and receive stock with it, which has often also been pretty nice and pretty great. We've been seeing employees confirm a stock arriving and it almost seems like we are on another brand new restocking wave which as well is also very, very nice to go and see. So that's a big thumbs up in my mind. If you guys want to keep on checking the target links down below, because we've been seeing a bajillion different stock as well, feel free to. Although we did have a little bit of issues too as well, where some folks were like, hey, finally got the notification for at my target pickup from my local store, bought one for pickup, but they actually had an issue where they actually had their order canceled, which would, in all honesty, probably break my mind as you guys can see it's at 9 52 a.m and it has been around this usual time stamp in case we're trying to find the console range it's been around like the 7 to 9 a.m range which has been the usual i would say typical range of what we're getting with stock and then as you guys can kind of go and see they had a pretty pretty sad uh basically items are not available and i would probably go and cry although as i mentioned we have been seeing a lot more Target stock showing up, we've seen a lot more stock movement showing up, and we've been just been having some pretty good vibes with Target. I do think as of at least today, Target should be a pretty big focal point. As I mentioned, we usually do have the Target links down below. Same with the Twitter and Twitch if you guys want to go and follow. And as well, if you guys have had a chance to see, surprisingly enough, I'm, kind of, I'm still surprised in this one, Walmart still has been having PlayStation 5s available for online stock in general. So in case you guys want to go check and see, we've been having some back and forth stock uh, when it comes to the PlayStation and uh, just general arrivals, stock arrivals, movements, everything. It's been kind of on the rougher side, but we have, like I said, we've had a few cancels, a few whatever general orders, but it is still available to add to cart. So if any of you guys want to do check the Walmart website and check out for the Horizon Forbidden West bundle, Man, I'd say go for it. Like, there's actually some pretty good potential with it, and we are still watching and looking for the stock itself. So, I mean, it's a little bit on the weirder side, though, because we have had a few canceled orders. We had a few issues with orders. We've, like, we've seen just kind of just weird stuff with it, but uh, at least as we have seen some stock, at least I'm happy because it is available as of, like, literally today. Like, I am never a big complainer. If the stock can be literally bought and maybe potentially shipped on out throughout the rest of the week, I'm okay with it, but... A big issue is that even for me, it's still saying like the Friday the 9th, we have been seeing date ranges from like the 7th all the way to the 16th or so. But like I think a lot of you guys would agree, just having the option for a console is just nice. So maybe go check Walmart, see if your local area has a good shipping price point or timestamp or whatever, 
and go and see. But as well, we've also actually seen some more even for PlayStation 5 showing up in the wild. As I have been mentioning, we have been seeing Walmarts in stores actually having stock. And as you guys can see, here's a nice little randy dandy PlayStation 5 Horizon for Benny West console showing up for the $550 price point. So we still have been seeing these. This is, like, I believe, a Walmart store. Uh, we still have been also seeing Walmart PlayStation 5s showing up in store and also general availability. So all around pretty good and pretty nice. So uh, I'm down. Like, I'm very, very cool with that. I'm very down with that. I very much approve with it, too. So... Keep checking your Walmart stores, keep checking your Walmart store locations, looking for stock and everything, and we can kind of go from there. So, big thumbs up, Maman, and I'd like to go and see it. Now, as we mentioned to Target, check the links, Walmart, check online and in stores, Best Buys. Best Buys also have been on the same vote of, say, the Target side, where we have been seeing and hearing reports of Best Buy stores having stock available inside their store locations. So we had a few folks that on, on the, as of walk-ins yesterday, did go and confirm that their local Best Buy stores did have stock. And as well, we did also have another confirmation too, that people were checking the apps, orders showing up in stores and getting casual stock with it. And it was overall pretty nice and pretty solid. The one big struggle, though, is we just don't fully know. Right now, it kind of seems like Target is taking more of the big, uh, like, focus versus Best Buy, which is surprising. But it kind of seems like that's just where the stock is moving and grooving. But it does also come with GameStop, too. As we've been mentioning throughout these past few days slash weeks, GameStop still has been having stock available and stock movement floating around. So just in case you guys want to check and see for stock, feel free to. If you guys would like, we have been watching and seeing stock available and availability for them, uh, at least for a little while, which has also been kind of nice, too, as well. So keep checking those stores, checking the stock, checking the movement, checking all that stuff in case you guys would like to. Now, as well, for other various things, Amazon. Amazon has apparently also been doing a little bit more on the online stock, so keep checking your emails, checking your normal stock, and checking your normal stock movement. With Amazon themselves, they actually have been seeming to be doing pretty, pretty good. Uh, so just in case, if they've done like another restocking wave or online normal restock. Now, when it comes to the PlayStation Direct, as you guys may have seen yesterday, it has now finally been sold out, which is surprising. Although we still see Walmart having stock, which is nice. Uh, but as you guys can see, the PlayStation Direct only has the register your interest. So make sure, if you guys have not done so already, go and register for the opportunity to purchase a PS5 on the PlayStation Direct. Now, they also have gone public, and the last public drop was up for like five days. So it does kind of give us a little bit more merit and a little bit more movement to like, you know, be aware on stuff. Uh, but at least on the one bright side with that is that we have still been seeing stock floating around and have been seeing some good stock moving. So uh, we'll watch and see throughout this uh, next upcoming week if they do any more proper drops. It did take like five days away to uh, sell out. But like I said, we can still register and get a free console drop either way. So it does kind of seem like Walmart still the big focus uh, and all the other good stuff for in stores such as Target, Best Buy, and Walmart as well. Now, for other various drops, we have been seeing very good stock for Fred Myers, Kroger's, and Smith's. We do keep on mentioning that. We have been seeing a lot of stock floating around. We have been seeing a lot of stock, just overall good vibes with it, which I do like to see. So check your apps or call or show up for your stores. It is a holiday weekend, or at least the start of it, so I may go and change up some stuff from that. When it comes to Myers, I think we did see a few little baby bit of reports. Of stocks showing up too, so also be on the lookout for that. BJ Wholesalers too as well, a few little bits and pieces of sporadic stock apparently showing up in the stores too as well, so also be on the lookout for that in case you guys would like. It does come with the, the Costco and Sam's Club. Costco has done weekend drops and have been seeing a few rumors for in-store locations having some extra stock. Same with Costco too, has also done even weekend drops and also in-store potential drops too as well, so be on the lookout for that. When it does come with all the other various drops too as well. Uh, Gamefly, still extremely overdue for any of their extra stock and bundles. Same thing too when it comes to Verizon for digital stores, walk-ins, and online. PC Richards and Dormont, all that good stuff. We are still watching that quite a bit. And as well, Staples too for their in-store walk-in and extra stock locations. HEB too as well. And all the other various mid-tier too. On top of that, we are still watching pretty closely but I do want to say I think the big thing is still just walking it looks like it also seems like Target 
is kind of the biggest focus as we've had a chance to see so definitely watch that and keep on looking for stock there and use the links down below make sure you guys are subscribed with the notifications on and twitter and twitch stream down below and everything else as well down below and i appreciate you guys all so much for watching in the first place